Well, we are here at the Almont Tennis Club this morning. You can see they are practicing their volleying drill uh, here this morning, and this is to, you know, to kind of learn the basics of tennis. This is going to help us, you know, get our sh volleying and shuffling together. Is that right? Yes, that's and right. And we're here and with Club Pro well. Hyacinth Breathing, which is huge in tennis. So what exactly are they doing? They are passing the ball back and forth yes. um, as a prelude to learning how to volley. So they meet the ball out front, and then they are counting out loud so okay. that they're, they're breathing out when they contact the ball, which is important in tennis. You know okay. all the grunts they hear sometimes right. on it's television. Very true. We do hear a lot of that on TV. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're going to be up next here. Any uh, pointers for me last minute? Well, just you're, you'll be shuffling. I'm going just again. shuffle no. and count. Shuffle to the side and count. Okay. Out loud, okay. Now I don't really play tennis, so I might be a little shaky. <laughs> well, here we go. Well, your hands are in good position, so okay. let's go. One, two, two, three, <laughs> four, <laughs> five, six. Seven, eight, <coughs> nine, ten, <coughs> eleven. You can count in any language. Do's. Thirteen. Catorce. All right. <laughs> cool. That's a go. good workout as well. You really get the feel of it. I do get the idea All right, of guys, don't, uh, don't slack it off here. Keep on okay. going. <laughs> And so just tell us a little bit about the history of the Almont Tennis Club, because you guys have been here for a long time. It's been around since uh, about 1898. Mm -hmm. And then in the current form that you see it, this plexiplay was only added about 30 years ago. Okay. And then we have had some um, upkeep to yeah. to go along, yeah. so they're in pretty good condition. And have you noticed the numbers growing over the past few years? I know Tennis Canada has said, you know, they've really seen tennis becoming more popular with the youth. Yes. The grassroots program that we have includes a lot of, of um, paraphernalia that belong, that splits the court for the juniors. Mm -hmm. So we can actually have four sets of games going at the same time. Okay. And we get a lot of help from Tennis Canada, <coughs> excuse me, mm -hmm. and our junior programmer. Yeah has been in, keep in touch with Tennis Canada and get a lot of in, information for So for why do you think it's becoming more popular? Do you think, you know, some of our Canadian I tennis stars are doing well? I think some of the Canadian players, mm -hmm. both at the junior level and the, also the adult level. Mm -hmm. And we know that we had such good representation in the recent right. Rogers tournament right. in, um, in Toronto and in Montreal. Yeah, so we've really seen, you know, it becoming more popular with the youth. And what kind of programs do you offer here with youth and adults? For the youth, there are some summer camps. We yep. have had two already run this summer, and usually there are half-day camps, and they've been full all the way. And for the adults, I've been introducing some challenges. Yep. Both, we have a mixed singles ladder, which we call a liberated ladder, cool. because both men and women are on the same ladder. They challenge each other to play, and after we get their, their, their results, they send to me, and then I tell them how many points they have All and right. they're really enjoying that. We also have a mixed double ladder mm -hmm. and we've also been inviting other clubs from the area to come and play some cool. inter-club with us. And, and you guys are pretty good. much open until you get snow on the ground so you still have quite a few more months left. Yeah, that's Hopefully right. yes. we won't get any snow anytime <laughs> soon. All right so yeah we're going to leave things here for now but when we come back we're going to learn a bit more about the game of tennis and we're actually going to get into some drills so stay okay. with us that's coming up next on CTV Morning Live.